hey planner buddy hey guys welcome back to another video today i'm doing my weekly spread in my dashboard planner for april the 18th through the 24th and i'm going to be using the alice in wonderland sticker book from the happy planner and also this um scrapbook paper from this park lane um kind of book scrapbook paper book i guess you could call it um yeah so i did this off camera i just put the uh strip of paper diagonally and then ripped it on the sides and then put it diagonally across the page um to kind of create this like i guess path or um yeah like a path i guess you could say um of alice kind of like falling down since this sticker kind of looks like that and it reminds me of that scene when she first um falls down the rabbit hole um, yeah, so I kind of wanted to recreate that in like my own little way. And so I'm just putting her there in the center and then putting all the other like little characters and like some little teapots um, also like floating down um, the little path as well. And then I put like a little bloom floral sticker um, at the bottom. So it's kind of like they're falling down to that, I guess, which is kind of like kind of cool falling down into the bloom. So you bloom i don't know it's just uh i thought it looked pretty so that is what i did um and then on the right side of the spread i am putting down my functional boxes for the week um trying to get more of the characters around the page like the queen of hearts um and then i'm also going to be adding the uh, march hair and then the mad hatter on the side of the page as well um so i'm also adding these little strips of washi uh tape stickers that are in the book that are like these really tiny florals that are super super cute so i'm just putting them on some of the boxes and some of the days um just to also use them up and then also just like to add more florals around the page um as well so here i added the march chair and then the mad hatter um also throughout the page just to get more of those characters um and then now i'm putting down these little like um little flags as like little bullet points on some of the days uh just to also bring in some of that gold foil and then also some of those different colors throughout the page then going back to the left side i put down a long box sticker um i didn't like that i already had the white rabbit um since i already had put him down but uh i meant to cover it up but then i completely forgot so i'll probably do that like later on my own um and then i put down some more of those little washi strips and then this little um quote that has like an arrow pointing down that says start at the beginning i think that quote from the movie is pretty funny so i liked that and now I'm just going to be going in with my gold metallic Uniball Signo pen. Um, I think I got this at Michael's and it also came with a silver pen and a white pen. Um, and it's really cool because it's metallic and um, the ink is really great. Um, I really like these pens a lot. Um, I use the white one all the time, but uh, occasionally I like to use the gold one to add in some accents um, in my spread. So that is what I'm doing. I'm kind of filling in all the empty space um, in with like little dots, little dots and swirlies and polka dots and all those things. Um, I just kind of wanted to fill in the space since it ended up a lot more empty than I thought it would. Um, and at this point, I really wasn't sure if I was liking it, but after I added all these like little details and things like that, I decided that I did really like how it turned out. So I'm using a variety of different pens that match the colors of the spread, like um, the pink, not the pink, like the purplish, the greenish, the dark blue, and then the gold. So um, I also am using here, I'm going to use the um, green Signo Uniball pen that is in green. Uh, and that's really pretty it's a really pretty color too it's a shame that you kind of can't see it but um i'm sure you'll be able to see it when i do the little like zoom in close up at the end of the video and then the purple and this blue are um these are called i think it's like scribbles that matter something like that um and they're like felt tip uh pens and yeah that, those are the ones that i use for that those are much more um like noticeable the uh, ink is very dark and it, it kind of spreads a little it's not the best pen but um for something like this uh it's okay so yeah i'm just adding the final uh, little dots on the bottom of the page just getting uh, this area that i had missed before and then i'm going to be adding two little circle stickers just to kind of bring in that shape um, around on this side as well and then adding the last two pieces of um washi tape that i had and that is pretty much it for the spread this one came out very quickly very cute in my opinion i really love how it turned out and of course i love the alice in wonderland sticker book 
from the Happy Planner, so I was just super excited to use this in my dashboard since I had already used it in my skinny classic. But yeah, I really like how this turned out. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Let me know your thoughts on this spread and on this sticker book. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will catch you in the next video. Bye!